a Japanese firm plans to grow 30,000 heads of lettuce a day with an entire staff of robots in 2017. By automating steps of the planting process, robots will chop personnel costs by about half and decrease energy expenses by one-third. Spread believes this move will also allow its group of human farmers to focus on developing sustainable farming methods and learn how to produce better quality vegetables. The futuristic factory will be built at Kansai Science City in Kizugawa, Kyoto, Japan by the middle of 2017 and will be an upgrade to Spread's existing indoor farm, the Kamioka plant. The plant currently produces 21,000 heads of lettuce a day using a small human staff. The farm measuring about 4,400 square meters, 47,300 square feet, will have floor-to-ceiling shelves where the produce is grown. Seed planting will still be done by people, but the rest of the process, including harvesting, will be done, by industrial robots, company official Koji Morisata told AFP. The move to robot labor would chop personnel costs by about half and knock energy expenses down by nearly one-third. Morisata added. The pesticide-free lettuce will also have more beta-carotene than other farm-grown lettuce, the company said. Spread uses vertical farming, which is a method of urban agriculture that grows produce in vertical stacks indoors and uses lead light. Not only does this technique increase production, but it also reduces waste and eliminates runoff from toxic chemicals such as pesticides. The pesticide-free lettuce will also have more beta-carotene than other farm-grown lettuce, the company said. Spread is developing sensors that will produce data about how certain types of crops grow on the urban farm. This technology will alert the human workers if the crop doesn't grow properly and they can adjust the technique. Although Spread is eliminating some human jobs, the firm noted its human framers will have more time to focus on investigating and developing sustainable farming methods and learn what techniques work to produce better quality produce. Construction of its Kazugawa factory is scheduled to being in spring next year and should be completed by the following summer, with shipments beginning in the second half of 2017. The entire farm will cover about 47,300 square feet with floor-to-ceiling shelves, which is where the produce will be grown. The farm, measuring about 4,400 square meters, 47,300 square feet, will have floor-to-ceiling shelves where the produce is grown. It will cover 51,665 square feet, 4,800 sq meters, and cost up to 1.7 billion yen, 10 million or 14 dollars million, which includes the costs of researching and developing the machinery. Although Spread hopes to automate every process, human farmers are still currently needed to confirm germination. The Robo farmers can't yet successfully carry out the seeding process either, because the seedlings are so fragile. Seed planting will be done by people, but the rest of the process, including harvesting, will be done by industrial robots, a spokesperson for the company. It will cut personnel costs by around half and knock energy expenses down by a third. In a press release last year, Spread said it will start the sequential shipment of goods from 2017 with the construction of the new factory and plans to have a production system of 80,000 heads of lettuce per day. In addition, we will expand the scale of production to 500,000 heads of lettuce per day in five years and will continue to expand our vegetable factory business domestically and internationally, the firm continued. Spread isn't the only firm developing vertical lettuce farms in Japan. Plant physiologist Shigeharu Shimamura recently set up an industrial scale farm inside a factory in Japan. Closely controlled using specially designed lead lamps, the farm is nearly half the size of a football field, 25,000 square feet, and is built in a former Sony Corporation semiconductor factory in Kashiwa, Chiba Prefecture. This farm uses 17,500 lights spread over 18 cultivation racks, reaching 16 levels high, and these lights are used to mimic day and night. By monitoring the photosynthesis process carefully, the system grows lettuce two and a half times faster than an outdoor farm.